Aussie Harold. Mate, how are you? Very well, mate. Good to, uh, good to be in Brisbane today. Yeah, look, it's been four months since we've seen you fight, but you've been very busy on social media, also with the Common Games and uh, challenges and goals, including not breathing out of your mouth. You like to keep yourself busy. What's been going on? How have you developed as a human? It's been a good, good four months, mate, since my last fight, and I've just been I'm always massive one on, on just trying my best to, to become a better human and I've just watched my boxing progress as well when I'm on that mission so the goal is always to become a better human first and, and become a better athlete second and just been doing heaps of weird little challenges mate and I've uh, been embracing a lot of time with my partner and stuff like that and been doing everything the doctors asked me to do after my last fight with my hand and stuff like that so had the last sort of six weeks punching on my hand and they're feeling good so I can't wait to get in there mate four weeks on Thursday and it's almost go time. Mate, the country's very happy to hear that the hands are feeling good. Yeah, about time, mate. It's been, um, been a bloody long year. About three months out from the Olympics, mate, I couldn't really throw my back hand. So I, um, it's been a long sort of 18 months almost. And just um, I'm grateful to finally sort of feel like I'm at the end of that pro uh, process. And I'm um, just doing everything the doctor tells me to do. And been doing a lot of recovery at Body WRL in Sydney. And they've got some amazing stuff there. Some, like, some stuff that nowhere else in Australia has. So just been doing that sort of stuff, mate. And, as I said, doing everything the doctor says, and you know, I'll be throwing my hand with all I can at this fight, thank God. <laughs> now, obviously, um, you've matured beyond your years as a boxer because of your work ethic, and you keep ticking it over in the gym. Oh, mate, I'm, I'm, I'm really excited about my future. You mean, I, I try my best, obviously, to live in the present moment and stuff like that, but I'm, I'm, I'm just really, like, this is a life that I've created for myself, and I've worked really hard, and I've got an amazing team around me, my mum, my dad, my team up here in Sydney, my team down in Melbourne, like I've got some amazing people behind me and I'm just really proud of myself, I stuck, stuck true to myself. There was many years in the making where I wasn't sure if I was going to make it and I lost many fights, I failed to make the Olympics five times. There was, there was many things playing into like if I had the belief in myself or not and I'm just really grateful and proud of myself that I stuck through all that and, and I'm sort of enjoying the fruits of my labour right now. Yeah, look, you made a big change. You left the family behind in Melbourne, obviously all the friends, even Jason. <laughs> I know, Jason Whaley, I tell you what, I miss him. I miss giving him a big kiss on the lips, that, that man, but uh, I love that man to bits and I love, of course, my coach, Brian Levere down in Melbourne, but you gotta, you got to make the move and, and, and you got to do what's right for your life and your career and, and this was the right move up to Sydney. So I've, um, I've had a great sort of 10 months since I've been up there and my partner lives there, which is great. And, um, it's only the start, mate, the start of the, the journey to world titles. And what uh, Harry Garside can we expect against Miles Zalewski? A smart, calculated you mean, Harry Garside. He, he's a tough opponent, Miles. He always comes to fight. He's got, I think, what, nine knockouts or something like that. He's got a great knockout record, so he comes to fight. He's entertaining. It's going to be a good, hard fight. Uh, but I'm feeling good, mate. I'm feeling good. I'm, I'm excited. Been obviously a few more months, but Johnny Lewis is always the best. So I'm excited just to showcase my skills, mate, uh, come 15th of September.